this is Damon from Let's Tiki.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make a morito. That's spelled M-O-R-I-T-O. And it's a twist on the traditional mojito. The morito recipe was given to me by Cook Locally on Twitter. You can find them at, at Cook Locally on Twitter. What makes the morito different from the mojito is that instead of using mint leaves, we're going to be using basil and instead of lime, we're going to be using lemon. It's really um, kind of an almost Italian or Spanish drink with the lemon and basil. And if you find the traditional mojito too sugary for you, I think you're really going to like this one because it uses far less sugar um, and it's very refreshing. So to start out, we need one large basil leaf. Got one here. Add it to the glass. And then we'll need a half teaspoon of sugar. Now you want to actually use real sugar instead of a sugar syrup because when you muddle this in a few, few seconds, um, the granules of sugar really help bring out the oils from the lemon and the mint leaf. So then what we need is two slices of lemon. And then we want to muddle this. If you don't have a muddler, you could also try a wooden spoon. When you muddle, you want to just gently muddle over the fruit and the leaves. And this goes, is the same for the mojito as well. Because um, you don't want to tear the leaves, all we're trying to do here is release the juice and the oils from the lemon and from the basil leaf. And right away when you start to muddle this, you get great smells of, from the lemon and from the basil. Mm, it smells really good. So that looks pretty good. Got that pretty well muddled. Then we'll add one ounce of vodka. And then um, we'll add some ice. and then top it off with some tonic. There we go. And then just to get it all mixed up well, we'll just toss it into a shaker and then just toss it back out. It's got great aroma of basil leaf and lemon. Mm, yeah, it's a very light and refreshing. The taste of the basil, I was kind of wondering how that would be at first, but it comes out really well and mixes great with the lemon flavor. So thanks to Cook Locally for your suggestion. And if you have a suggestion for me, just let me know. You can find me at letstiki.com or on Twitter at, at letstiki. Mahalo.